I'm Tim, the festival director at STIFF, Seattle Transmedia and Independent Film Festival. And I'm Will, the programming director for Seattle Transmedia Independent Film Festival. All right, this is another episode of STIFF TV. Hey, okay, we just want to uh, thank our sponsors this episode, uh, Lucid Lounge. And uh, Dicole Vodka. With us we have Dave Wilson, who has a project called The, the Weed School? Weed School the Movie. Weed School the Movie. Dave, uh, why don't you just give us a little, um, little bit about your background? You started making commercials and music videos. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, I actually started, um, you know, just doing lighting on movies and stuff, and I got into camera work and started shooting a lot. Eventually, that I got to direct some commercials, and you know, I'm a filmmaker at heart, and so I started uh, trying to get my own projects going and you know get scripts out there, and you know, just trying to figure out, you know, writing scripts and everything, and then weed starts to get legalized and all this money and all these people trying to figure it out and I'm just looking at it like this is so absurd like what's happening it's you know it's a comedy film you know and like the day that I was thinking about it I, I walked up to Columbia Holistics which became the sponsor and they were just like you know it's crazy like we want to film it I'm like I'd love to write a script <laughs> a lot of the people that seem to be wanting to sponsor and promote a comedy, a stoner comedy, are, you know, weed companies, basically. Yeah. So you're able to focus, like, very locally. You're not calling some big New York or California. You're, you're calling I'm, Seattle companies, Washington companies. The, the whole thing is, you know, it's we're depicting Washington State and everything that's absurd and going on with the weed laws and legalization. But it's very, it's very Seattle. It's based in Seattle. Uh, it's very community, you know. You know, we're throwing parties, you know, with, with the cast and crew and with our sponsors. And I've got, you know, amazing uh, musicians involved and bands involved just for my connections, you know, and whatnot. And so there's a lot of people just coming together. It's a community thing. But it's not just a short film. You, you have other plans. You're going to take this to, um, like, a, maybe a TV show, webisodes, other types of things? Yeah, it works as a short film. You know, it's I have I have the feature ready to go, but I you know I don't you know can't raise that much money right now, and so it works as a short film that's um, can you conveniently pilot size, pilot episode size. So I've developed out a sort of a bible, you know, for for the the um, television series. But the idea is, you know, we're doing little shows like this. Um, we're doing little cook, you know stupid ass cooking things. We're doing these little viral media things. So it's all branded content. And it's not one thing, you know, I can't like, as for me, like the business model behind it, like it has to work, you know, I have to give value to the sponsors. And so I have to put something out there and whether it's like, okay, here's a series of clips, maybe the movie, you know, I can't put that out yet, but I can, I can, you know, we get, you know, 50,000 views off of all these little things that I'm doing, you know, the brand gets pumped out there somebody else sees it, we get some more money, and we can continue on, but I want it to work, you know, I don't, I'm not, I'm not going to go out there and risk everything on a feature film and not be able to finish it, and then everybody's, you know, looking at each other, like, what happened? So yeah. you're, kind of, you're kind of leaving your options open in terms of, like, the final product of the project, like, because what I'm hearing you saying is that you're, you're putting together a short film, but that short film happens to be pilot-sized, so right. you could actually turn this into a series yeah. if you wanted to, it, 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 along possibly with a feature film. Exactly. And if somebody's so, more interested in supporting a series, if I can go to Amazon right. or somebody right. and, and they're, uh, they're like, whoa, we love it as a series, you know, I'm still going to try to make the feature, yeah. you know, but it but can work as a cartoon, it can work as right. a video game. Right. It's a franchise, you know, it's weed school. It, your, we've business, created, your business model is flexible. Right. Yeah. We've created our own characters to depict everything that's happening. So there's right. the good guys, there's the bad guys. Right. You know. And I think that's think a lot. Sort of a, it's a conspiracy thriller, stoner comedy. You know? okay. But it sort of like plays out as like, just the whole thing sort of played out as this like South Park, Park episode. Sure. The whole 502 law sure. and everything. It's just completely absurd. Right. And 502, for those of you who don't know, they're watching right now, is the law that was recently passed in Washington State to legalize marijuana for recreational purposes not for medical purposes right. but you know the more effective the thing can be the more of a chance it has to keep existing mm -hmm. you know? mm 
mm -hmm. it's useful to people and you and find people want that, to share it. that using that transmedia approach to the making of this project the, the using the different um, platforms mm -hmm. like you know the musical element the, the maybe the web series that it might turn into the short film that it'll become the feature or the TV mm -hmm. series that it may become and within that yeah all part and parcel exactly it's it's project. it's all integral really and you know we're doing now I've got you know some of the writers are doing fake blogs with, as the characters and mm -hmm. stuff like that so we're giving like a three-dimensional element to these yeah, characters nice. so you can know them on a you know a better level than so there'll be an you interactive know, element too. Absolutely. In, in the and with that people can come to the website, look yep. at the blogs of the characters, leave comments for the characters, and so yep. there's going to be an actual interaction between your exactly. your audience and the actual characters in the film. Yeah, exactly. That's great. That's, and that's and fantastic. with the actual movie, talk about interactivity. The actual movie itself is a smoking game. Too. Mm -hmm. So we're really looking forward to, to seeing uh, seeing what you're coming up with. It's weedschoolthemovie.com. Uh, yeah, weedschoolthemovie.com, uh, Twitter, at weedschool, uh, Instagram, at weedschoolthemovie. So what's uh, the, the best way to get invited to one of these parties? Follow you on Twitter? Or? Twitter's, right now, it's the best way, like, we'll have the information on, you know, Facebook, and, and there's, like, a Weed School the Movie page on Facebook. Right, cool. Instagram, but we'll post, put the posters up, so. Cool. Well, Dave, it was yeah, a pleasure awesome. to you guys. It's great yeah, having you guys. Thanks for coming in. Yeah, thank yeah, you. Yeah, thanks for watching this uh, episode of Stiff TV. Come back next month and we will have a new and exciting guest.